Welcome to PC Wits Kids Tech Talk. Today we're looking at part two of my Windows tip for hiding and now it's unhiding files and folders. So basically in my previous video I showed you how to hide files and folders in Windows 7. This tip also applies to Windows XP and Vista. Here I'm going to do it in Windows XP and as you can see here I've got the hide folder and also I have the hide file option on my right click on the context menu and I'm going to go back into the registry so click on start type reg edit in the run field and open up the registry editor and navigate to this point here just like I showed you in my first part and you'll see that the hide file option is there already we want to create a unhide file key and in that key we're going to do the same thing we did in part one of this tip for the hiding of the file so we're going to right click here on the side create a string and the name of that string is going to be has lua shield same name that we used earlier to hide the file and under that we're going to make a sub key and that one is going to be command as well so type in the word command there and then on the right hand side double click on default and then for the value data you're going to put in this value here and notice that now it says minus h instead of plus h the minus h of course to remove the hidden flag that attribute and uh, and then you're set now if we go ahead and just test it out here by right clicking on the file you'll see that you have the unhide file option okay so there you go it works as you can see in windows xp and now the next step is to do the same type of steps for directories so how to unhide a directory that you've hidden so navigate to this point here under the h key classes root slash directory so all the way down the d's all the way down to directory here it is select that expand it and then go to shell and then expand shell and then under there again we're going to create the uh, key for unhide folder so right click on that click on new key and then type in unhide space folder okay and then on the right hand side here again new string value and then put in the same string value that we put in earlier so has lua shield make sure that you do the typing properly there and then after we have that entered properly then we'll create a new sub key so right click on unhide folder and create a new key call it command double click again on the default and put in that same attribute minus h exactly spelt as i showed you earlier and that's it now you've got the option to unhide what you've hidden so there they are so pretty simple straightforward if you hide something it goes dim and um, no other users that log into the same pc under a different user id and password will be able to see these and um, if you by accident can't see it right so you're not necessarily that user you can still figure out where this is if you know that it was located on your desktop for example that folder this is the path in Windows Explorer to that desktop so you can actually type in my sp space stuff for example at the top and still get to that folder if you know that it exists same thing if you open up a command prompt right if you know the folder name and the exact location on your computer you could actually navigate to it you'd have to type it in so cd space myspace stuff for example and then the folder would still be there even though you've hidden it but you'd have to know exactly the path okay the directory so there's a quick tip hope you enjoyed the uh, video again on hiding and unhiding and uh, thank you for watching